Okay, guys, what we're going to do today is to show you how to create a standard curve. I'm going to show you two methods to do this. The first is a serial dilution, and all I'm going to do is a one to one ratio of my standard. So, the way to do that is to take your pipette, to check that it's at the correct volume. I've already put two mils of my top standard into the first tube, and all I'm going to do is translate one mil from the top standard down. Put the pipette on, go down, and I'm going to take one mil up making sure there's no air bubbles in the pipette. I'm just going to mix that by pipetting up and down gently into the second tube. Come out completely, take one mil from that second into the third tube and repeat that process. Pipette up and down again gently, go down to second stop, out, back in, and repeat for the third tube. And what we've done here is that we've basically created a serial dilution. So you can see in the first tube here, we've got a much more intense red color and it gets lighter as we go down the standard curve. So this will be our top standard of known concentration. This will be at half of that concentration, half again and half again. So we can create a standard curve quite easily that way. Once you've done that, you take your pipette, press the button at the back and eject into the yellow bin. Okay, the second method we're going to use is to actually dilute our stock solution. So this is our top standard. I've already put two mils into the first tube. And what I've done is I've pipetted different volumes of water into the next four tubes. So in the first tube, I've got half a mil of water, one mil, and then one and a half mils. So I've calculated how much I need in order to create a standard curve. What I then need to do is to add an appropriate amount of my standard. So for this first tube here, I have half a mil of water. So I'm going to need to add one and a half mils of my top standard. So I'm going to take my die and adjust my pipette. Remember, you need to unlock the pipette and adjust it down. So I'm going to need to make one and a half mils into there. So I'm going to set it to 750 and then pipette that twice. You lock it into the first stop, into my solution, pipette up slowly. Add to my first tube, go into the second stop, and repeat. And then what you want to do is you just want to make sure you pipette up and down a few times, gently, just to make sure you've properly mixed your solution. For the second tube, I'm going to have one mil of water, so I'm going to need to put one mil of my standard solution in. So that's again to 100, which is one mil. Fresh pipette. and prepare one mil in. Again, going down to the second stop, you want to make sure you just really careful times just to mix it. Now for the final one, I have one and a half mils of water. So I'm only going to go down to 500 on the pipette. Make sure you lock it. Pipette up and down a couple of times. So that's two ways that you can create a standard curve. Again, you can see in the first two, you have a more intense colour blue, which gets less as you go down. This would be your top standard, which is a known concentration, and then you will have a quarter, a half, sorry, three quarters, a half, and a quarter of that concentration which you've created. So there's the two methods. You can either do dilutions where you know the volumes or you have known volumes which you dilute one to one and then you work out the concentration from that.